this location. Um, another used deck. This is the Grimoire series, Elemental Magic. It's got that nice uh, metallic lettering. You can see how shiny it is. There's some embossing on the deck. Um, it's a little bit raised. Maybe you can catch that as I'm moving around. Yeah, there it is. So, ever so slight, Edgy Brothers. Uh, produced by Expert Playing Card Company out of Taiwan. So it says on the bottom. It says Poker, Edgy Brothers. Yeah, Elemental Magic Playing Cards on the side. And then on the other side, it says uh, Ignis Aqua Era Terra. Which uh, I'm not sure. It's probably a tarot tarot card. Uh, actually, it's um, air, water, earth, and fire. That's what it is. Yeah. Elemental magic. Oh, and of course the back, very colorful. Nothing's raised here. Yeah, I think we got all four there, right? Earth, air, water, fire. Oh. Pretty cool. Triangles on the corners. All right, let's open it up. Nothing, nothing fancy about that. I guess this has little triangles here too. There we go. That's the card back. That's what was on the um, on the box. I guess it looks a little different because of the, there's a white border on the card. We've got uh, you know this colored background. These I guess are the jokers. So basically the same illustration. One's colored, one's not. There's a lot of um, traditional decks that that do that with a joker. One will be colored, one's not. Oh, these are very, very interesting. So there's your ace of spades. It's got the four elements. The water element. It's got a really neat design inside there. Um, all the numbers are a little fancy. And they've chosen to put a frame around it. With the peep, the fancy uh, icon, the fancy pip uh, there, which uh, sometimes they don't do that. Um, they'll just do a plain one there. Huh, that's fun. We got your uh, your water creatures. For the uh, king, queen, and the jack. Okay, so the diamond, flower, symbol. Kind of attractive, colorful uh, deck. Yeah, the earth. got this um, you know they got the frame around it they got the frame around here then there's a frame going around the back you know it goes behind his head and then there's writing back there you see that so those are all you know design elements that choices that the uh, edgy brothers made I was gonna say this is stuff you can you think about when you if you want to design your own deck or you're designing anything really um, how you want to put it together those they're all choices you know so these pips are kind of interesting too now I'm not sure if this was oh this is air okay yeah this must be air because it looks like it's blowing wind get the ace King, Queen, 
jack. It looks like a tornado. Keeping with some of the same traditions where the, the queen's got some sort of leaf or uh, some of them, sometimes the flower. The king's got a weapon. Some of the jacks traditionally have weapons and some of them don't. And the fire, as you might expect, has got fire. Get your ace. So the face cards have got this extra frame, but the regular number cards don't. They just have the frame around the, the number and the pip. Well, I guess that's the Suicide King with the, the sword behind the head. The jacks are pretty wild, huh? They're more uh, spirit. And the uh, the kings and the queens seem like they're they're some sort of creatures, but these jacks look like they're even more elemental than than the king and the queen. Anyway, this is a pretty neat pretty neat deck. Hmm. Grimler series. Elemental magic. Thanks for watching.